Three innocent bystanders struck by stray bullets when a man riding a scooter suddenly starts shooting after colliding with a car on a busy Kensington Street corner. Surveillance video shows the dramatic scene that left three people wounded, including a teacher and a little girl shot in the head while being driven home from school. Thursday night in the big story in Action News is the latest in the search for that gunman as two adults and an eight year old girl continue to recover from the hail of bullets. Action News reporter Leland Pinder is live at Philadelphia Police Headquarters with more. Leland. Rick, two of the three shooting victims are members of the school district of Philadelphia community, a teacher and a student, and we're told the superintendent met with families of both this evening. Tonight, we're also getting a look at a possible suspect in this case. Philadelphia police are looking to identify the person in this surveillance photo in connection with a triple shooting along East Allegheny Avenue in Kensington just before 3 p.m. today. Three innocent people are now in the hospital, including an eight-year-old girl. I was over here. Everybody's taking cover. Surveillance video shows a scooter driving down the center of the road while cars are stopped so another driver can make a left. Police say the driver making that turn did not see the scooter and the two crashed, sending the scooter operator rolling onto the pavement. The operator of that scooter gets up, produces a handgun, and starts firing indiscriminately in this direction. Maybe like nine shots, seven shots, something like that. A 47-year-old Conwell Middle School teacher was struck in the face and shoulder when bullets came through the windshield of this Audi. A 45-year-old pedestrian was struck in the leg and an 8-year-old shot in the head seen here in this photo provided by family. She was in the car with her dad who had just picked her up from nearby Elkin Elementary School. Maribel Silva is a family friend. When the father took her exactly like a second two minutes after that, that happens there, you know, shots. That guy was reckless, you know, reckless. He shouldn't have done that. The scooter operator who police say opened fire and the driver who hit him left the scene. We're looking to identify key markers in the video to see if we can clearly identify the shooter. Yeah, if that person looks familiar to you or you know anything that can help detectives in their investigation, you are asked to give police a call. Concerning the victims, police say all three are in stable condition. Live outside Philadelphia Police Headquarters, Leland Pender, Channel 6 Action News. Rick? All right, Leland, thank you.